Hi, my name is Hannah Joyce, and I have a thriller. The name is Missing. It's a story about a podcast journalist who searches for the truth about a missing person's case. But when he uncovers the truth about what he's searching for, he must decide between telling the truth to further his career or keeping his mouth shut to protect the innocent. Missing. Act 1. Jason Grooms, an up-and-coming podcast journalist, has just finished an investigative season that has really put his name out there. So much, in fact, that a man from a small town in Kansas shows up at his L.A. studio asking him to work on the four-year-old cold case of his missing girlfriend, Dawn. Hesitant at first, Jason is intrigued by a few suspects in the case, including the Kansas man himself. Act 2. Jason flies to small town Kansas to to investigate further. He is welcomed by Don's family, who is still desperate to find her as well. Don's mother tells how distraught they were when she first disappeared, noting that their suspicion went first to her boyfriend. However, their suspicion died when her boyfriend hired a private investigator after the case went cold. He seemed just as des desperate to find her. The next suspect was her best friend, who didn't claim to have any information. However, she was the last to see Don alive and is so tight-lipped, it seems like she's hiding something. Lastly, Jason suspects the local authorities may have gave up on the case too soon. And one deputy even threatens Jason, telling him to stop snooping. Jason's investigation is getting nationwide attention. And then he finds her. Or rather, she finds him. New information from Don's perspective completely changes his investigation. But he is torn. Does he tell his listeners he found her and get the praise of solving this case? And then he finds her? What if he kills her? Do you know how many listeners he would have, sol have if he solved this case? How his career would shoot off? What if he takes her daughter? The police will protect her, that's what they do. But they didn't before. Act 3. Jason has a plan. His investigation turns toward the boyfriend. How can he bring him to justice without hurting her? Jason digs into the boyfriend's past relationships, calling up many of his ex-girlfriends, but not many are willing to talk with him. Finally, Jason gets a break. But before the boyfriend is taken into custody, the private investigator hired by the boyfriend finds Don. A scuffle ensues. But Don prevails and the boyfriend is arrested. Don finally comes home and introduces her daughter to her family. The end.